Hi guys, it is Wednesday the 1st. It's April 1st. Don't worry, I'm not gonna play any dumb April Fool's jokes on you because I hate April Fool's Day. It's like my least favorite day of the year. I, it is like five something in the afternoon. I totally forgot to film this morning. Not so much forgot as I was all gross. I didn't feel like doing anything. And I started getting a cluster headache. So I took half of an injection. I figured out how to split my injections. It didn't really work. It sort of took the edge off and I could feel it, but it didn't really work. So I, um, drank a Red Bull really, really fast because apparently the taurine and the caffeine can do something to abort a cluster headache and it didn't work, it didn't really work and then like 40 minutes later, I feel awesome. It's my first ever Red Bull that I've ever had and I downed it in about seven seconds. I mean, I literally drank the entire thing in like seven seconds um, and I feel so good. So Red Bull really gives you wings. I just feel so good. like. I have energy, I feel like I just wanna, th I mean, like it literally, I drank the Red Bull and when it kicked in, I took a shower and brushed my teeth, like within five minutes, got completely dressed. My whole filming area and room is clean and, well, except for my chair right there, just ignore that, but yes, I am like ready for the day at 5.15 p.m. <laughs> All right guys, I'm gonna go get my makeup on and I'm going to go film videos. What's new? Hey guys, I am cooking bacon. Because that's just what you do, right? I'm also watching Amanda Muse, who I love dearly with all my heart. And I just got out of the shower. It is Friday the 3rd of April. I'm going to try and film a video. And then tonight, my sister, uh, it's Good Friday today. And my sister's part of the worship team at church. So I was probably going to go and watch her do her little worship set at church. And support her while she's singing. Because that's what she do. Last night... I went to her church with her and it was after everybody was gone and we played music for like two and a half hours and it was so much fun. We were singing and it was just a freaking blast. So I, I, I absolutely loved that. It was so much fun. No. This is the first time he's ever been outside. Yeah. Mama's still not gonna let him be an outside cat, that's for damn sure. He can only come out here when he's supervised. Cause him's blind and him will die. <gasps> oh, what happened? Something scare you? Oh honey. Was it so scary? <laughs> you can see how blind he is when he trips over the little edge. I wanted to film this for you guys because it is a or just stay outside today. It is still the afternoon, but it's so nice. This is my backyard that you guys are in. I'm not gonna show you too much, um, but I just wanted to show you guys my backyard because we have a gardener who was the previous gardener to this house. For those of you who don't know, we moved, we bought a house in October. And so this is our backyard. And what I love is that the house came with a gardener who is cheap, guys. He's like 25, 20 to $25 a week. And he comes and he mows the lawn and he, he takes care of the garden. Here, let me show you. He edges the entire yard, so he makes the lines like really clean and everything look really nice, and he is so mad cheap. But I wanted to show you guys out here by my tree. I don't even know what those are. Bluebells? What are those? And tulips, and tulips are my favorite. Granted, I do live in Washington, which is Tulip Place, but look at me, Toms. Oh, I could just die of cuteness. It feels so good. Yeah! Oh my big boy! Oh, sorry, boy! We gotta get, we gotta get right here with Chrissy and her camera. Better do the trolo pose! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh. Oh. That first, this, is a, this is a video, so... Hey, ready! Woohoo! <laughs> Hey guys, it is Thursday the 9th at 8 o'clock in the morning. I am heading down or up to Vancouver, BC to get my hair done. This is the before. It is green, it is faded, and I am not gonna tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make you watch so you can see what I'm gonna do. 
Bye bye. Green hair. I am in the bathroom at Access Hair Salon in Vancouver. Really weird toilet flusher. It's like on the wall and you like press this button. Never seen anything like that before. Anyway, this place is so stylish and so like not anything we have in Washington. So I am up at Axis Hair Salon in Vancouver, BC because I've seen some Instagram posts from them to show that they do really good hair. So that's where I'm at getting my hair done. I just used their bathroom. My appointment's not for another hour, so I'm just gonna sit around and wait. This is the after, I, I love it so, so much. Driving in Vancouver is like hell to me. There are cars everywhere, there are cars switching lanes everywhere, there are people flipping each other off, there are a bunch of lights, there are trolley things on wires, there are people walking in front of your car like this bitch. There are just signs and wires and it's like hell to me. I think my GPS is taking me the wrong way but I honestly don't even care because look at this street 100% cherry blossoms like are you shitting on my face so beautiful I could cry I'm going to go get my nails done because they are looking so bad they're so grown out I don't exactly know what I'm gonna get but I think I want to do something with like some gems on it or some sort of like design I don't know I want to do something like interesting so We'll see. My sister and I have keys to the church because we um, are friends with the pastors and we're playing music. You love me cause I'm fragile. even know the last time I vlogged I literally can't remember it is the 14th of April and I just made a plaster cast of my face and I wish I had shown you when I was doing it I didn't even think about it because my sister was over here and she was helping me wow I can totally see it in this film now it's so weird oh my god look at that no neck profile oh just get some definition in there I am going to start making my own prosthetics and things I'm really trying to get a lot more into the special effects side of makeup um, so I'm gonna go fill it with plaster of Paris and I'm gonna let that sit for 24 hours till tomorrow so we'll see kind of how this goes and I'll let you guys know what my cast turns out like I hope it turns out good um, from the tutorials and stuff I've seen it looks like it's gonna work so I'm really excited oh hey guys um, I may be a beast right now <laughs> I am just I just finished uploading and there's just hair coming off of me. I just finished doing a collab for Instagram with a gal. I'm watching Pretty Little Liars. I'm gonna shut this shit off. I just finished a collab um, with Claire Bryant MUA on Instagram. She asked if we want to do a Beauty and the Beast collab. I said, fuck yeah, and I want to be the beast. I'm a beast and this is an annoying cat. What's new? I am about to take all this shit off of my face, but I thought I might want to film it because this beast. I have been doing this for the last four hours. I've been sitting here working on this beast face, which. If you see it and it, I'm talking and it doesn't look very good, but in the picture, which I'm flashing on the screen here, it actually looks pretty good. So I have to take it off because it's just so uncomfortable, but this crepe hair shit is so cool. Like, I just really enjoy it. I created this prosthetic, which doesn't look great. In pictures, it looks much better. <laughs> and these are my little vampire teeth, which I'm going to take out. Ow. Um, they are these little, like, you know, those little teeth that you stick here. 
Okay, thumbs. But I stuck them up in my gums. I am going to take this off now because I look crazy. I feel like I look like the grandpa on Roly Poly Oly. I now know what it feels like to have a beard. It's so sucking. This is me trying to remove the pain. You know what guys, I actually think I'm gonna end my vlog here. I'm gonna end my vlog in the beard. Thank you guys so much for watching. <laughs> uh, if you would like to, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. It will update you when I put out new videos, which is every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Also, if you would like to, follow me on Instagram, because you can see shit like this. And I'm learning to do a lot more prosthetics and special effects makeup, and I post every single day to Instagram of 2015. So go follow me on there if you care to see cool makeup stuff. And I think you guys do because now I've intrigued you. I thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you at my next video. Bye. I was editing my video and I decided to add a little blurb onto the end of it because I started this vlog on the 1st of April and now I am on, today is the 19th, I think. Um, but that means that I am, I got a cluster headache that day, and then uh, two days later I started feeling a shadow come on the next day. Um, but I've been pain free this entire time because I've been drinking two Red Bulls daily. I drink one in the morning and I drink one in the afternoon. And it's controversial, controversial, it's controversial to some people because they hear Red Bull and they think it's so bad for you. But honestly, when you compare that to what I was doing, which was taking sumatriptan every day, um, taking these horrible injections all the time, I will take Red Bull any day. I just guzzled one just now, it's 11. I guzzled one this morning at like six. Um, that's two already so far. I may need a third one, because I've been slightly feeling, and I'm talking slight shadow of pain when I woke up this morning, just very, very slight. But I know cluster headaches, and I know what it feels like when one of them starts to come on, and that felt kind of possibly like maybe that's what it was gonna be. So I just guzzled a couple of Red Bulls, and I'm feeling great. I feel fine. It's the weirdest thing. So it's 19 days, and I just can't believe it. So I just had to report on that to let you guys know that <laughs> it's still working. Look how adorable.